check, tool belt check, hard hat check. I put it, it must be here somewhere. It can't have just disappeared. What a mess! Ah, Wendy, have you seen my phone? <laughs> no. Just look at this office, Bob. No wonder you keep losing things. It's not that bad. Yes, it is. It's a disaster. A workplace needs to be kept tidy. You know that. Hmm. Hang on. No. Aha! Thanks, Wendy. See, I didn't need to tidy up after all. Uh, have you seen my tape measure? That's it. You may be the best builder in Spring City, but you're also the messiest. Today, your job is to stay here and fix the office. Oh, OK. Can I fix it? Yes, I can! Whoa, Shifter! Slow down! Steady! Sorry, Lofty! But stacking pallets is fun! Good morning, Lofty! Shifter! Hello, Hello Mr. Mr. Bentley. Bentley! Lovely day for doing a spot of building, eh? <laughs> Hello. Only me. Oh, Mr. Bentley. <coughs> I forgot you were coming. Oh, dear, dear, dear. I don't know what Mayor Madison would say if my office looked like this. She'd probably say what Wendy said. Get it sorted. Yes, but she'd say it a lot louder. Now, I just popped in for that design you kindly drew up for my new garden shed. Oh, right, yes. OK, I'll just get it. I know it's here somewhere. I can't wait to get building. I'm quite a dab hand with the old drill, you know. <laughs> I'm sure you are. Ah, here you go. You can pick up the materials you need from the yard. They're all listed on the plan. Wonderful, Bob. Many thanks. Good luck with your tidying. Thanks. Think I'll need it. Shifter, I need to collect all the bits I need for the new garden shed that I'm building. OK, Mr B. What can I get you? We'll start with the timber. Uh, according to this plan, I'll need... Uh, oh, 30 pieces of 2 by 4 30? Brilliant! Need a hand? That's quite an order. Thanks, Lofter! Brackets, screws, hinges... And 20 pieces of 2 by 6 20? Wow, that's a lot for a garden shed. Well, that's what it says on Bob's plan. And Bob knows best. Hey, Lofty. That's right, Shifter. Bob does know best. Then there's 10 cinder blocks, the plywood sheeting... I'm on it! If you want it shifted, call for Shifter. I'm the guy. There's no one next to you! Well, steady there, Shifter. Slow down, steady. Nice and careful, remember? Yeah, yeah. Sorry, Lofty. You know, I think we're going to need two ton to carry this lot. Ah, I think it's a brilliant idea, Lofty. Museum. M for museum. That goes under M. Uh, vet. V for vet. So that goes under V. <sighs> this is thirsty work. I think I need a cuppa. Now... Where did I leave my mug? That's it. I'm ready to roll. Splendid. Thanks, Shifter. Thanks, Lofty. Good luck building your shed. Bye, Mr. Butler! Oh, yes. I've seen some sheds in my time. Back in Moose Jaw Creek, they made sheds out of ice. What happens when the sun shines? Sun? <laughs> You've never been to Moose Jaw Creek, have you? 
Let me tell you all about it. Leo. Uh, Wendy won't let me out of the office until it's all tidy. Oh. Which means you'll be supervising today's build. Me? Oh, wow! So what's the job, Bob? It's a giraffe house at the zoo. Uh, I have the plans here somewhere. Oh, this is awesome! I can't wait to get started. Me in charge of a build. Uh, ah, yes, here you are, Leo. Just follow the plans. You won't go wrong. Oh, thanks, Bob. Oh, wait till I tell Dad. See you later. Anything I can do to help, Leo? Bob's put me in charge of building a giraffe house at the zoo. A giraffe house? Can I help, Leo? Can I? Oh, of course, Lofty. I expect it will be a really tall building, so I'll need your help. Come on. The sooner we collect up the materials, the sooner we can get started. Yay! OK, so I need six pieces of two by six. Six? That's not very many. Mm, that's what it says on the plan. And Bob knows best. <laughs> yes, that's right. He does. And 20 pieces of two by four, four cinder blocks, plywood sheeting, brackets, screws, hinges. No, that's four by eight. Oops, sorry. Too much to carry. We'll get Shred to help us out. Did somebody mention my name? Oh! Hi, guys! Hi! Hi. This is so exciting! I've seen Bob's plans and they looked brilliant! Ah, Bob's the best. So, one giraffe house coming up. Can we build it? Yes, yes we, we can! can. Alright! Done. This is one tidy office. I think Wendy will be very impressed. Sorry, Bob, but I am sorting it out. Yes, it does look a bit messy. It's like I always say, a workplace needs to be kept tidy. Oh, is that what you always say, Bob? Ah, oh. <laughs> hello, Wendy. I, uh, I was just, um, I finished the office. Yay! I've just seen it. Good job. Thanks. Told you I'd fix it. Hello, Tread. What's up? I think you'd better come along to the zoo, Bob. We've got a little problem. Uh-oh. I suppose it might just fit a baby giraffe. But I designed it for a grown-up giraffe. How... Why is it so small? I just followed the plan you gave me, Bob. Uh-oh. This is the plan for Mr Bentley's garden shed. What? Let me see that. Oops. But if I have the plan for Mr Bentley's garden shed, then what does Mr Bentley have? I only wanted somewhere to store my lawnmower. I'm so sorry, Mr Bentley. This is all my fault. I got a bit mixed up with the plans. Oh, oh. Now what are we going to do? I suppose we'll have to dismantle this and rebuild it at the zoo. Hmm. Maybe not.
you are, Leo. The plan's for Mrs Johnson's new fish pond. Ah, thanks, Bob. And for you, Wendy. The plan's for Spring City's first Olympic-sized swimming pool. See you later. Bye. Or should that be the other way around? Leo, Wendy, hang on! Guess what? Wendy says it's going to be Bob's birthday soon. Oh, wow! We can have a party! Yay! Yes, and she's getting him a present. It's a surprise. Oh, I wonder what it'll be. I don't know. Wendy! Wendy! What's the surprise? Shh, fuck! Well, what's the surprise job today? <laughs> no surprises today, Scoop. It's a big day, though. Is that because we have to finish putting in all the steel supports for the skyscraper, Bob? That's right, Leo. Just like this. We're finishing this part today. These supports hold up the rest of the building. And then after that, we'll be able to build on upwards. Whoa! That is awesome! Yes, it'll be the tallest building we've ever built. Now, Lofty, you'll help me, Wendy and Leo. Right too, Bob. Not forgetting Tiny, of course. Hi there, Tiny. Ready for some tower power? Morning, Bob, everyone. Oh, yes, tower power at the ready. Excellent. <laughs> Scoop and Muck, you'll dig the trenches for the pipes to bring water to the skyscraper. Will do, Bob. Yes, Bob. So, team, can we build it? Yes, we can! I know what Wendy's surprise present to Bob will be. Oh, go on then. What? It'll be... A new motorbike! Oh, yes, Bob would love that. Back in the moon. Or maybe it'll be a new saxophone. Hi there, Scoop. Oh, hello, Roland. Wendy asked me to deliver this. Why, what is it? I think it's something for Bob. Something for Bob? Pop it in here, Roland. I'll make sure Wendy gets it safely. Great. Thanks, Scoop. Say hi to her for me. Will do, Roland. Bye. 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 What's happening? Look at this. Look. Roland just brought it. It's something Wendy ordered. And Roland thinks it's for Bob. Hadn't you better give it him, then? No, don't you see? Wendy ordered it and it's for Bob. So it must be her surprise present for him. Oh, yeah. I get it. Oh, but it can't be a motorbike like you said. It's much too small for that. It might be a toy one. Anyway, the point is, we have to give the box to Wendy, but not when Bob is around. Uh... I'll just pop it over here. OK. Remember, Bob mustn't see it. Right? Right. Uh, OK. Got it. Steady. That's it. OK. It's in place. Thanks, Tiny. You're welcome. Hey, Wendy. What's up, Bob? I think this power driver's going to break down soon. Has the new one I ordered come yet? No. I asked Roland to pick it up and bring it over. He should be here soon. Oh, OK. I'll go and take a look. Oh, no. It's Bob. Bob's coming. Huh? Hey, what are you doing, Buck? It's Bob. He mustn't see the box. No, no, leave it where it 
is. We can stand in the way or something. Uh, I'll pick it up now. What shall I do? Uh, take it away. Pretend you're going to the spoil heap. Hi, what? guys. Hello, Bob. Um, I'm just off to the spoil heap. Again. <laughs> oh, OK. Well done, Muck. Everything all right, Scoop? Oh, hi, Bob. Yes, fine, thanks. Uh, busy, busy. Good. Right. Now, has anything come for me today? Any delivery? Oh, oh, uh, a delivery for you, Bob. Uh, no. But, um, if something does come, I'll let you know. Of course. Straight away. OK. Thanks, Scoop. See ya. See ya, Bob! <sighs> oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, oh, hello, Bob. Everything all right? Sure thing, Bob. <laughs> OK. See you later. <sighs> now what? Oh, I know. Lofty. He'll know what to do. Lofty! Look! Uh, it's a box, Muck? Yes, I know, I know. But it's not any old box. It's Wendy's birthday present to Bob. Oh! And Bob mustn't see it, Scoop says. And, um, and... Hey, Lofty! <gasps> More stills, please! Coming right up, Leo! So, why not just give the box to Wendy? We're going to, but not when Bob's around, because it's a surprise. So, I want you to hide it for me. Righto. Wendy! Over here, Bob. Hide it, Lofty! Oh, uh, 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 quick, quick, quick! Uh, oh! OK, done it. Where is it? In your jumper. Oh, right. Thanks, Lofty. Hi, Mac. Everything OK? Yep. I just popped out to see Lofty. Right. So where's Bob's surprise? Uh... Oh, no. What do you mean, oh, no? Lofty put it in my dumper and... I forgot. What? Oh, Mark! Oh, great! I'm sorry. I can't see it! Oh, no! Oh, I'm sure it's in there somewhere. It has to be. <sighs> it really has broken now. I need that new one so I can carry on. I'll ring Roland and find out where it is. There it is! Gotcha! Oh, Mark! Bob's coming! Hide it again! Oh, uh, here you are! No, Mark, don't give it to me! Uh, stop it, Scoop! I don't want it! Mark! No! Yes! No! Yes! Scoop! No! Oh, yes, Wendy! Cover it over, quick! What happened to the parcel Roland brought earlier? He says he gave it to you. Oh, uh, it's, um, d d you know. Oh, 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 you mean Bob's surprise present. Muck! Oops. I wasn't supposed to say that, was I? What do you mean, surprise present? Oh, Muck means the one Wendy's giving you for your birthday, Bob. The one Roland brought. Oh, Scoop, that's not a present. That's Bob's new power driver. We can't finish the build without it. Oh. And we've been trying to keep it out of his way all day. I got that wrong, didn't I? Yes, Scoop. I'm afraid you did. The question is, where is it now? Um... In there. Sorry. <laughs> oh, Scoop. <laughs> well, really. Excellent. Now, if we all work together, we can still finish on time. Can we do that? Yes, we can!
Network team, we did it! Hooray! Nice one! Oh, uh, Wendy, what are you giving Bob for his birthday? Mark! It's supposed to be a surprise, remember? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I hope it's something really good, like a new motorbike or a saxophone, maybe. Well, you'll just have to wait and see, won't you, Bob? <laughs>